keep the camera out because you can cut my head off. No, no, no. Alright, ready? Okay, so we're going to make some porridge. Alright, so we're going to do a healthy porridge. So what I've got over here is organic rolled oats. So these are jumbo oats. This is the least processed of all the oats. Oats is naturally gluten free. So, uh, and it's very good for you, but I can't miss that. It's an oats and all that kind of stuff. It's so processed. That's not good for you. So the beauty of what you can tell is this is a uh, whole rolled jumbo oats. That's what you're looking for. Rolled oats. That's a bit. That's a more bit. And the other way you can tell is by the carb content. This is, um, 56%. So you want to get the carb content as low as possible. But once you mix it with water as well, it will go down even further. So it's probably down to like 20% carb content, which is what you're looking for. Uh, now I also put wheat gem in it. Um, which is, yeah, wheat gem, which is great. Again, this is organic. And the wheat gem here is 35 grams of carb, uh, and 8 grams of sugar, and fiber is 50 grams. So that brings the, uh, carb, total carb content to probably about uh, 20, 25 grams, which is so, this would mean it's low carb. Uh, and I've also, for a and also for, uh, a stuff, uh, I'm going to set me So I've got black set me and I've got normal set me white set me seeds. They can be loads of, uh, calcium and that kind of stuff. Really good, and they taste good as well. Because you want to, you want to taste good as well, yeah. Are you talking about washing them or something? No. Okay, I'll show you what I do. So I'm just putting a bit of these in. Now I'm just putting a bit of these in. So this is, uh, white and black, let me see. That's quite a lot you put in. Yeah, we're gonna make, uh, like a bit big one, yeah? Mm -hmm. So this is just a jar, yeah? So there's not many, mm -hmm. too much. And then I put, um, some, um, and what I've learned is the important bit is that you don't go about halfway, yeah? Mm -hmm. Because these are gonna double in size, it's gonna expand. So as long as you use the half the jar, so don't go the half the jar. Is. I think that's, yeah, one less. Put about half a jar. Perfect. And then we just put water in. So I'll go here. So I put more water in it, so I put some water in it, and normally I'll spit out, so the water will go up to the top, and then you just leave it. What do you mean non normally, why not? Now I'm going to do it because we're running out of time for that. So I'll spit out the water, and what I'll do all this will expand. So the, what, the ideal way to do it, if you're going to have it in the morning, which is when you would normally want to have porridge, uh, is you'll do it at night, mm -hmm. and then in the morning when it's expanded, mm -hmm. and then you just slowly cook it. Uh, in a pan, uh, and what I use when I'm cooking it is I put uh, coconut milk into it because I love coconut, and uh, I also put them uh, uh, ghee in there, mm -hmm. you know, to uh, for to put, get some more fat in there. So, and then I slow cook it, and then I add uh, like um, I said, you can add slices of avocado in there, uh, some berries, uh, bananas, that kind of stuff, just to give it that extra flavour. And there you have it. So it only takes like 10 minutes to, uh, to start to cook, and there's much cooking to do. Once it absorbs all the water, it becomes, uh, quite easy then to cook it. Mm -hmm. Um, uh, because, you know, a lot of work, I mean, that's just easy to cook and cook it. But, but if you try to cook it straight from there, you have to do a lot more cooking to the top now. But this has much of the work for you. So yeah, there you go. So that's how you make healthy porridge. Uh, that's it. And sorry.